Howdy, it's me again. Today I'm gonna be eating uh, Del Taco. We got this, uh, it's new to me. I don't know if it's a permanent menu item. It's the crispy chicken bacon burrito. Barbecue chicken, my bad. Um, basically it's, uh, it's three chicken strips with bacon, lettuce, tomato, I didn't get tomato in it because I'm not really a fan of tomato like that. Um, and then ranch and barbecue sauce. So if you're not a fan of ranch and barbecue sauce together, then this might not be for you. But I figured I'd give it a try. It looks pretty unique. Let's see how it looks. All right, well, <laughs> I just unwrapped it and uh, this thing is like bursting. Like It's thick chicken popping out it's, it's a big you can see my hand it doesn't really go all the way around it. it's a big burrito um, so let's give it a bite Sorry, I took a I took a big bite. I wanted to get all the flavor in. I'm drinking lemonade, by the way. Um. No, I still got stuff on my face too. Um, I. It's not too good. I'm gonna keep it real with you. It's not too good. It uh. Feels. Everything in there feels out of place. You know, you shouldn't have to put chicken strips inside a tortilla with barbecue sauce and ranch and bacon and lettuce and say it's a burrito. It's it's more of a wrap and a bad wrap at that. Um, the bacon in there, very crunchy, overcooked, flavorless. Um... Oh yeah, I think it's also got, to make it, to add on top of the crunch, it's also got like uh, tortilla strips that are crisped up. So you got a lot of crunch going on in here. You got a crispy chicken tender, you got burnt bacon, and you got uh, these tortilla strips, all crispy, too much crisp, and then you got some soggy lettuce that's got barbecue sauce and ranch all over it. Um, give it a four out of ten will not eat again I kind of don't even want to eat the rest of it but uh I had a feeling it might be weird so I got um all reliable which is actually kind of a secret menu item not too many people know about it so there's a half pound bean and cheese burrito from uh del taco right um, it's a value menu item the thing is you get a bold. Now, some people know about bold, some don't. If you get the burrito bold style, they add french fries and sour cream into the burrito as well. So it's not just a bean and cheese, it's bean, cheese, fries, sour cream. It, it just gives it that that, that goodness that it, that it deserves, you know? So I'll give this a bite right here. It's just, it's really, really saucy too. Yeah, right away, I'm happy again. You know, this is, uh, I've been getting this for years. Sometimes I talk to people about it, they don't know what it is, so you gotta let the world know. Let's see here, it's got the fries, bean cheese, 
sour cream. Simple, yet elegant, and uh, a lot cheaper too. I think this, uh, that chicken burrito is around $5. This is like $1.50, $2. And it's a half pound. So uh, you'll be full off of one, really. Two is pushing it. I'll give this a 10 out of 10 every time though. Chicken burrito, I think I said four out of 10, I don't remember. I like to do these all in one take normally. So, <laughs> yeah, but uh, overall, I recommend not getting that chicken burrito. I mean, unless you like ranch and barbecue sauce together, then be my guest, but uh, that's all I really have as far as the review goes. I'm gonna be doing a lot more reviews in the future, not just on like food, but drinks as well. I got a request the other day after I posted my first video and uh, they requested me to do all the Red Bull flavors. If you didn't know, Red Bull makes a ton of different flavors of their drinks. I've had a few of them, but I've never like officially reviewed them. So, and I think that person that requested it, I will also be doing it with them. And it'll be like a joint, like I'll have them over here, joint review. But uh, that'll be later on. But for now, mainly food. And I'll try to post regularly at least once a week or more if I can help it. But I promise at least once a week. So until next time, see y'all later.